and welcome to me build of the Three Blind Mice Invitational Dodge Van. And what a casting this is. It weighs an absolute ton. And the paint, I think the paint was half of the weight because of the decals and the clay coat on top which when you get to the end you'll see I've not been far off similar myself it's only a very quick video this here I am I used brake fluid to get the paint off so no caustic bath of doom this week and here I'm putting on some primer and spraying it just I need a new cans of primer I'll probably get a few different colours but I'm getting towards the end of it and here I'm putting some silver undercoat well chrome undercoat um, and here this week I've invested in a new airbrush and here I'm using it to just put some clear on the windscreens I'm gonna to have to get some of that proper floor clear polish for it it's just Tamiya's just not doing it for me really and here I'm starting spraying the colours I'm starting off with tiger eye brown from the green stuff world inks set and I'm gradually getting the knack of spraying the stuff it's a bit tricky as you can see it's not a perfect paint job there I don't get a perfect paint job but there's a lot of steep learning curves here I'm getting used to and this month I've had a very short time period I've only had today to work on it and I've been planning a decal workout uh, decal layout making my own decals and working out the here I'm trying to work out am I putting I think I'm putting the sparkles on basically the mirror flake and I'm having to work out a better way of spraying that to be honest as I say it's only very short this because I've not had a lot of time today I've added a lot of new ideas you can see the flakes in the air there bombing around I'm not kidding my bedroom's like a furry bloody castle now and here we are I'm peeling off masking because I wanted a clear surface for decals to go over my homemade decals I fancied trying this for a while to make murals on custom vans and I'm just touching, I've touched in actually I'm just doing chrome detailing on it now not fantastically but hey uh, oh, it's only a quick go today I've got some, I finish up with quite a nice job some aspects could be better with more time anyway here comes the finished result and you can see them multicoloured flakes glittering looks really nice on dark paints you just see all the colours of the rainbow glitter in it as light catches it I've not got the best light on this to capture it with but you can see um, as they catch the light there you go particularly on the back there I've got to find a, a brush that'll I think I need a bigger one than a 0.3 milli and I'll probably be better off with a gravity feed and stuff I've got to find a better way of laying it down but the basic idea is there I suppose it looks quite nice 
Anyway, all I have to say at the moment, if you've enjoyed it and it's only been a quick one, please subscribe, even better. If you ring the bell for notifications, that'd be superb. And um, we'll just carry on looking at it for now. There's eight rotisseries round, here we are, I've moved it. So the light catches a bit better and it's the sparkles. So you can see all the colours reflecting. Once I get the technique down, it should provide some really beautiful paint jobs, to be honest, some custom ones with a mirror flake. I've got a big bag of it, so it should come on. I just want a way of doing it even. Because it does make it quite a pretty bill. I think if I'd have had just that little bit more time, I could have done a nicer job to work out. Not, I'm happy with the side decals, but I'd have liked to work out a nice one for the rear and something on the front panel. But as things go, I think it's turned out quite nice. And. All in all, a pretty good effort, I think. Anyway, catch you on my next vid, and bye for now.